אתה רואה? אני רואה, מה זה? תגיד, שתים יותר מדי? לא, 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 כולנו רואים את זה. מה זה? חמישה עיניים. שיואו! שיואו! רוד, בלם! מה זה? מה זה, אימא? מה זה, ראית? יואו בנברות. ראית את זה? תראה, יש שם עוד. הנה, תראי, תראי, תראי שם. מה זה? אימא לדור. ג'ודאיזם, מה זה? זה סמלים. פרה אי, רפה, פרה אי, ואי, נו דה פה ואי, פרה אי. תם, תה תרמנו מויטו, קאר. פרה אי, רפה, פרה אי. קראלו, ואי. קראלו, ואי. פוט, אונדי כתה אגורה פה. הלו, הלו. Véi do céu, falei que eu tava vendo alguma coisa, lá do teu lado, lá, pô. Nem, nem quatro horas ainda, velho, até me dei para lençóis voltar pra Bauru ainda. Olha isso, velho, olha isso. Olha, puta, você não tem que ver onde o Zul vai buscar isso aqui, velho. Você não tá vendo nada aí, filho. Você tem que ver aqui na, na máquina. Ô, Rafa, tá virando, velho. Puta que pariu, velho. Ah, essa porra, essa bateria tá acabando, bicho. Caralho, velho. Tá descendo, porra. Peraí, para de ser medroso, caramba! Puta que pariu, bicho! Tá tremendo pra caralho, bicho! Deve ser caralho, eu vou saber, pô!
kind of didn't see before because the sun, the sun yeah. was just flashing by. Co to jest? Ufo? A ja trzeba krzyczeć. A gdzie? Nie wszystkie. Ej, patrz, ten ma czarny i ten ma czarny. Ej, nie? Ty to tak cicho. Trzeci ma czarny, co patrz. No, bo widzisz, one gasną. I lecą na dół. leci na dół prawie. Ej, co no, no właśnie. No. Jakbym była pijana, to bym się to... Patrzcie, co to kuźde. Co to jest? Foki. Patrzcie, tam już spadają na. Te na lepędzi zderzą się. A ty nie wiesz, na dół. Nie wiesz, na dół. No tak, ale nie wiesz. Na dół, na dół. Co to może być? Просто пипец какой-то. Смотри, еще появляются слева, блядь. Где, откуда? Вот слева идут. Видишь, еще появляются, блядь. Слева я не знаю, это где. Ну, над домами, блядь. Вот, видишь, две штуки еще, блядь, идут. Ха-ха! Космические корабли. Ну, это жестоко. Я ж тебе сразу заразу, блядь. Ну я слышал. Охуеть надо, блядь. Твою ногу. Я Под даже не знаю. Идут, я, я даже не знаю, куда смотреть. Под облаками идут, блядь. Под облаками. Он... А что, а что снимать? Я даже не знаю. Ну, тут, все их снимают, тут их миллион. А как я тебе их все, они в камеру не вмещаются? По очереди, блядь. О, сейчас попробую хотя бы один увеличить. Один он уходит влево, видишь, блядь. Нет, я хочу увеличить его. А. Максимум. Сколько смогу. Ну шар и шар. Куда насчет такой? Вон они вправо пошли, видишь, блядь. Ебена мать. Тут 50, блядь. Да не меньше 50, согласен. Да они все, все равно лезут и лезут. So Yeah, it's coming from the, uh, look at those clouds. Those suspicious looking clouds right there. There's one right above us coming down on top of us. Sure. I've never seen anything like this before. Neither have I. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Oh, I know. Uh huh. What the fuck? Погоди, погоди, я тебе отвечаю, там что-то летало. Во, 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 офигенно.
What the fuck? Офигеть! Л.О. прям над нашим сраным городом. Блин, я знал, что они существуют. Слушай, они как будто разговаривают, да? Вообще клево. Все, пропали. This is not a UFO. What is this? Boston, sit, please. What the hell? Oh, those are birds. It was going to the right, straight down, and now it's going to the left. Zooming in. Oh, wait. Oh. That was a bird. I'm trying to get it. Sí, 
se están separando. Se están separando, tú mira. Ya, qué chula. ¡Oh! ¡Concha tu madre, mi amor! ¿Qué es esa weá? ¡Oh! ¡Concha tu madre! ¡Tengo miedo! ¡Oh! ¡Concha tu madre, mi amor! Tiene formación triangular ahora. ¡Oh! ¡Mamá, llámame! ¡Sí, mamá, llámame! ¡Concha tu madre, mamá, llámame! ¡Oh! ¡Oh! ¡Concha tu madre, mi amor! ¡Mi amor, no lo estáis grabando! ¡Oh! ¡Concha tu madre, mi amor! Mi amor, no, no se está grabando. ¿Qué? ¿Esta weá? Se fueron, se, se salieron del foco. Oh, ¡Concha tu madre, loco! ¡Concha tu madre! ¿Se separan los pelos? Tengo todos los pelos que veo. ¡Concha tu madre, loco! ¡Qué chucha! No los veo. ¿Sí? ¿Se dividieron en dos? Sí, weón. ¡Ah, oh, concha tu madre, weón! ¡No, puta! Vienen para acá. Weón, ¿qué es esa weá? Se sí, vieron entre. Tu mamá no lo va a ver porque está para el sur, tu mamá mira para el norte. Look at those helicopters, they're all going, they're like... Yeah. Look, watch. Dude, look, government Yeah, they're about to make a mistake. Government helicopters. She's gonna go be nosy. Yep. Yeah. There's still one more. There's still one more. There's still one more. He's like... He doesn't, he doesn't give a fuck. He's like, I'm right here. Send your fucking helicopters, G. Look at that. That is... What is that? You hardly... What is that? I know, I mean, I know, but that's like, it's like a special ops fucking destroyer, like, what do you call it? <laughs> <laughs> military sending yeah, in, heading over the there. military sending in their fucking what if, what if there like, army uh, shit. Dude, what if we just see a helicopter explode right now? Boom! Alright, uh, here we go, a helicopter's heading over there. All we know is that orb of energy is still there, bro. It's still chilling. Oh, he's like on Look, he's turning. They're turning, bro. They're circling it. Oh. Bro, they're circling it. <laughs> Dude, no fucking way. Look at the music. Is that another one? It's small. They're circling it, bro. It's going right by it. You see that shit? Yeah. The, the, I think I only see two now. How's your one? Is What's your one? dude? That one right there is like a gangster. Like oh. he's like.
A UFO in China's skies forced Zhaoshan Airport to stop operations on July 7th. Outbound flights were grounded after the unidentified flying object was detected by a flight crew. The incident has captured the attention of Chinese media. And theories about the UFO's identity are burning up on the internet as well. They include everything from a hidden U.S. bomber to an elaborate man-made hoax. For now, the UFO continues to be a mystery. A spokesman from China's Civil Aviation Administration confirmed to ABC News that the matter is under investigation. Some Chinese residents are on edge this morning after another apparent UFO sighting. It's the second one in two weeks. The first sighting was on July 7th, and an airport had to be shut down. All right, that's a UFO if I've ever seen one. Yeah, can you that's identify it? That's undeniable. It, it, the airport had to be shut well, down after people apparently saw twinkling lights above the airport terminal. Seventeen flights had to be diverted. The last, the latest sighting happened just two days ago, and people say they saw four lantern-like objects forming a diamond shape in the air, hovering in the sky for over an hour. An right. aviation expert say they don't know what it was. It wasn't a plane. Scientists from all over the world are trying to figure out what caused a mysterious blue light to spiral in the sky over Norway on Wednesday. As UFO sightings go, this one was as good or as weird as it gets. A light appearing high in the Arctic sky, baffling those who saw it and exciting a lot of comment. Early yesterday morning, just before dawn, this appeared in the Norwegian sky. A blue light, small at first, growing into a spiral and then disappearing into what appeared to be a black hole. In the northern community of Trondelag and on a Norwegian military base, cell phones snapped, video cameras rolled and bloggers got busy. That tonight, Norwegian authorities are investigating strange lights seen in the Arctic sky. The spiraling white light was seen for several minutes Wednesday morning. Locals say the light appeared to be bigger than the moon. Thousands of Norwegians bombarded the Meteorological Institute to ask what that light could have possibly been. Some feared it could have been a meteor. Others a black hole, and there are even those that thought it could be aliens. A strange spiraling white light was spotted in the early morning sky over Sydney, with even skeptical witnesses wondering if it was a UFO. The unusual sight was recorded by hundreds of people from Victoria north to Queensland. A spiral in the sky around a bright light. Scientists left baffled by an unexplained circular light seen hovering high over Moscow on Wednesday evening. People described it as seeing a wide circular formation in the sky. Footage capturing the spectacle will help whether scientists and, and specialists find an explanation for the event. What was in the skies over Jerusalem? And why did it stop over one of the most treasured sites in Christianity? There's a new video this morning that some say may be proof we're not alone in the universe. A UFO in the form of a bright light is seen descending over the dome of the rock in Jerusalem. The video is said to be taken over the weekend. Uh, then suddenly the light shoots up into the sky. Here you see it. Another video from a different angle uh, appears to show the light doing the same thing. 
Now it is sparking intense debate on the internet. Trace Gallagher following this live from our West Coast News. So the question is, what was that UFO? What was it doing over Jerusalem? And, you know, is he back? Yeah, and that is the question, by the way, Megan, because, you know, critics, it's, it's difficult for them to dismiss this because there are so many different angles. We've got four different videos, all from various perspectives, but they do not know of anything like this in the Israeli army. All right, because listen, I don't, I don't like to be scared. I, I just can't take it. It's, you know, I don't know what it is. Well, I wish I could give you an answer to this bizarre sighting. I really can't, but I can tell you that earlier today, there were dozens and dozens of people right here on 23rd and 8th. They were standing right here, and they were all in a stupor, just crowded together, looking into the sky. Well, a lot of people are looking up. It's because of a mystery in the sky. Is it a balloon, a UFO? Whatever it is, it sure has a lot of people talking. I would assume reporter Jeff Begay says live in Chelsea where crowds have gathered. Jeff, what's this all about? Well, Sade, we don't know. Да не сын, не сын, пока еще ничего нет. Арт подготовка. Ебать. Что такое? Хуя я заснял материал. Да. Да, за куртками, пошлите сбегаем. All of us on this planet are on the brink of a kind of close encounter. A big asteroid is hurtling through space, and it's supposed to miss us by a cosmic inch, just 17,000 miles. That's closer than some of our weather satellites. In fact, it's so close, scientists are springing into action. And here's ABC's Neil Karlinski. Right now, while you're watching this, a chunk of space rock big enough to level a city is hurtling towards our planet eight times faster than a speeding bullet. The good news is, scientists say it will miss. The scary news is, the 130,000 metric ton asteroid called DA-14 is the size of half a football field and it will be much closer than the moon. In fact, it will thread the needle between Earth and the roughly 600 satellites around us, the ones that your cell phone relies on, possibly even smashing one to smithereens on its way by. But if that's why you're thinking this is all still a long, long way from all of us way down here walking the streets, you may want to think again. 
The last close call turned out to be a direct hit. It was 1908 and luckily it hit the middle of nowhere, Siberia, decimating a thousand miles of trees but no people. If a very large asteroid hit, it would probably create the same kind of disaster that wiped out the dinosaurs. Amazingly, no one knew DA-14 was headed our way until a Spanish dentist and amateur astronomer randomly discovered it a year ago. NASA doesn't have the resources to look for asteroids, which is why a trio of American astronauts and rocket scientists are raising money to launch their own asteroid early warning system called Sentinel, a dedicated telescope scanning the stars for threats. This asteroid is a wake-up call that we should be looking out there. These things do hit the Earth. Scientists say we can keep the planet safe if we just know what's out there. the sky. An NBC6 viewer was in the right place at the right time when a meteor was passing overhead. This is video of that meteor as it happened. Now, reports of similar sightings happened all across the state from Jacksonville all the way down to Key West. Starstruck, and did you see it? The Bay Area dazzled by a dramatic and unexpected fireball in the sky. Good evening, and thanks for joining us on this Friday. I'm Raj Mathai. And I'm Jessica Aguirre. The sky's brimming with action. First, an asteroid skims past Earth tonight, and now a meteor streaks across the Bay Area sky. I want to show you the dash cam uploaded video on YouTube that shows what appears to be the fireball as it crossed around 7.45. Close, but no cause for alarm. Scientists have dismissed any chance asteroid 2012 DA-14 will pose a threat to Earth. It's about 50 metres wide and weighs about 130,000 tonnes. No object of this size has passed so close to Earth since records began, and it's an event that only happens once every 40 years. The close approach of this, this object 2012 DA-14 on February 15th is nothing to worry about. Its orbit is very well known. We know exactly where it's going to go, and it cannot hit the Earth. His second term, from looming questions over Benghazi, to the war in Afghanistan. Keep it here as our special coverage of Inauguration Weekend continues. Noch mal genauer hingeschaut, also da scheint es nicht zu geben. Trotzdem, ähm, Herr Professor Schlepfer, an diesem Tag ähm, sollte man sich vielleicht Nein. Da, der Tatsache vergewissern, dass wir alle nicht ewig leben und so ein bisschen uns der eigenen Endlichkeit ähm, vielleicht das noch mal gewahr werden. Ja, natürlich, aber das machen wir nicht gerne. Das ist unsere große Angst, dass wir vorbestimmt dazu sind, einmal zu sterben. Das macht uns Angst. Und gerade solche Katastrophenszenarien lenken von dieser Angst. Ja, Woga! Und ist damit auch ja, ein Kakusia! Und vielleicht sollten wir uns bemühen, ein bisschen gelassener unserem eigenen Ende entgegenzugehen. Ja, nicht mehr gut. Weil es unausweichlich ist. Vielleicht kommt dann ein bisschen mehr Lebensfreude auf und mehr Energie für die positiven Dinge des Lebens. Ja. Yeah. Two lights, that Steve. Yeah.
stationary, isn't it? I'm just going to get it lined up with a light. Oh my god, that's that's just look at the way it's moving though. Forming a triangle now, dude. That is so fucking weird. What is that shit? Do you guys see that? Up there, look at the, the lights up there, dude. What the fuck is that? No, that's weird. Está rarísimo. Completamente rarísimo. That's not a broma. I don't know what that is, but and they just two of them disappeared right now. Wow, that is really weird. That is super strange. Two of them just disappeared right now. What the hell? Get out! It's the angels, Jesus. Alex, Mercedes just called me in the backyard. Your whole, your whole sky is lit up with great big gold dots. They're aliens. They're moving everywhere. Your whole sky is lit up here with great big gold dots. Go look outside and see Alex. No, they're, he ain't going to see him. Yeah, yeah, mom, they're not. A, okay, mom, will you take him inside? Do you hear me? Go with Granny. Your whole. Look at that one over there. Look at that one. Did you just see that? Oh, we're taking a picture of it right now. Hold on. Come on, chill out. She thinks it's Jesus. God. It's not Jesus. It's far from fucking Jesus. Are you filming it? Yes, Mom. Oh one just God. like spun. Jesus? It's far from Jesus. <laughs> oh Could be Jesus coming to pick us up. Why are you laughing? I was like, they're... I'm calling you, I've seen Oh my god, I've never seen anything like this in my life. Oh, look at how many there are. <clears throat> okay, Sadie's is filming them. Okay, Alex, we're in your backyard looking up at the sky. And there's about... 25, 30... 30 yellow, gold, They're something going real slow. Alex, it looks like aliens or angels. It's very, it's, uh, I've never seen anything like this in my life. Yeah, I just came in.
Jag har en ball av att jag har Eu tô vendo. Peraí, peraí, peraí. Peraí, tá dando volta. Cara, ele tá descendo, Você tá filmando, você tá? Tô filmando. Tô filmando. Tá muito longe essa. Tá cedo, cara. Ele tá em cima do chão. Então. Cinco horas. É o Papai Noel chegando. Viu? Tá muito baixo, cara. Eu acho que o Papai Noel. Vamos um pouquinho mais pra frente, já mais perto. Deixa eu voltar. Não, peraí, deixa eu acabar aqui. Vai acabar. Vamos chegar mais perto, não, 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 não. Vai lá, vai lá, vai lá. Vamos chegar mais perto, cara. Ele tá na frente, vai lá embaixo dele. Vamos lá embaixo dele. Vamos lá embaixo dele.
kelihatan dua UFO sedang berkeliaran di kawasan Mentari, Sambil. Kelihatan seperti uh, permainan, tapi mari kita saksikan visual ni. Describe, describe. How long has it been here? What do you think is that, Mr. Nanda? For the past half an hour, they've been kissing. Mr. Nanda has no lap here, eh? Those are straight up UFOs. Whoa! Holy crap! Whoa! Dude, that's the craziest thing I've ever fucking seen.
Mysterious lights hovering in the skies across several parts of the country. This video is from Indianapolis of a strange formation that appeared this week. Now, people in Metro Detroit say they've seen something just like it. For years, the Air Force conducted an investigation of so-called UFOs. They found no official proof anywhere from the fence tonight about those strange lights. Well, you wonder if the military is involved as one of our uh, UFO experts uh, was curious there and mentioned. We did put some calls into Selfridge, the FAA. We didn't get any reaction. Could be a logical explanation for some of these light displays. I'll tell you this, there's no full moon right now, but we're getting an awful lot of reports of lights in the sky. Huel? Certainly not a weather balloon, Ron. All right, thank you. That's right. <laughs> It just came out of nowhere. Down at Maya. Shh. I know. On three. Whoa. Whoa. I know what in the world came out of nowhere. Came out of nowhere. What in the world? This is some stuff. This is some stuff. Okay, Mike. Somebody has got to be shooting it. And now they're all going on to the ground. Look, watch another one. Come what is that, though? I don't know. Can you see it? This is unbelievable. Unbelievable. It is right there. 8.45. What is going on? There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 20 at least. Here comes a, that sounds like a military chopper. What is that? This is, get some pictures. This is truly unbelievable. I am in uh, Chandler, Arizona. It's November 7th. Oh my goodness. This is amazing. Some of them are in triangle formation. Wow. I've never in my life seen anything like this. How many do you think there are? I have no idea. It's scaring me. This is unbelievable. They're still coming. What are they? I don't know. We saw a big triangle formation in the same quadrant of the sky on November 2nd. Cars coming. Last time I did this on the second, people blowing their horns at me. Oh, there's another row of them coming back there. Look.
It's 845, November 7th, 2013. We're in Chandler, Arizona, which is southern South Phoenix. There's still some more coming up from behind that tree. I hope they show up in the video. I can see them flickering in the video, but they're not flickering when I'm looking at them. There's several more behind that bank of trees. I saw four. They just haven't came up yet. That's crazy. Where do they all go? I have no idea. There's some over there behind that tree. Four of them. There's my daughter. I don't know where those other four went. They were in a vertical line right behind that tree. Same distance away. Are you serious? You still see them? Yep, there's still one up there. And there's an airplane. Why am I always with you when we see I'm these things? I'm telling you. Things? I'm glad I came back. I thought for a second they looked kind of like what we saw. See, there's one over there behind the tree. See it? I saw four vertical ones behind that tree, but the, I saw like 30. And the, but yeah, but they didn't come up over the tree. That's crazy. I don't know, guys. That's facing north. There's the moon directly behind me. Wow. One after another. Most of them are so faint that. I didn't think I could pick them up. When I attach the scope to it, I'll get some detail. And look at this crazy. What? Yeah, we are just they're swimming. Which I have this thing upside down. I can't find a zoom right now to zoom in. A million of those, or not a million, but a couple dozen. Breaking my neck looking up in the sky at these things. Where'd go? Where'd go? I had two dancing around each other once last week, and then they were close together. Let's run to find another one because this guy's swimming with him. Yeah, that's a duck. I'm down at the river. Enjoying the last couple of nice days of warm weather. They're, uh, they don't like to fly here in the, uh, there's the zone. The ones I filmed back in Murraysville are not down here. direction and stuff. Oh, no, no, no. Tony, the skies are just loaded. Everybody, I highly recommend you getting some of that night vision. And 
just go look up at the sky. There's no way these are all satellites. Most of them uh, earlier were, they were all heading like south, uh, up oh, down. Uh, they were all kind of heading south, uh, you know, in one straight line. These ones are weaving and bobbing all over the place. Straight up in the air, by the way. I'm glad the LCD thing tilts. Because I don't break my neck doing this. Stick it up in there and wait for something to move past. We're having the last party of the summer. There he is. Got some Orby action over here, Michael. Got some Orby. Whoa, another one. Oh, yeah, they're just there. Oh, oh. yeah, bet. Then. I'm tired, too. Oh no, 
Straight up in the air, people. Let me try to get them over there. Torches over here. I know they're not just showing up for me. I don't think I'm special in any way. I just think that there's that many of them. And anybody that has a... Cost me thirty-three hundred dollars. Ed Grimsey on UFONV.com. He's UFONV on YouTube. They were my inspirations for springing for the good stuff. Well, it's another one. To spring for Generation Three. Navi the former Navajo Jimmy. this and uh, you guys get your own equipment and go out and look at the sky that rumor about October 13th I know they're already here so I don't think they're going to pick a particular day to uh, be over top of anybody uh, but I'm just glad that everybody might be curious enough to go outside and look on the 13th of October and if you're I think you'd probably be lucky if you have night vision at least. And you'll probably see something. Like I said, those glowing uh, fakers, what we call them. They're not down at this location. Whoa, that was good. Hmm. That looked like a meteor. Because it burned out. And it had a tail. Look at that one. Oh, that's good. Bubbly looking one. A little more difficult to follow. Oh! Where'd that guy go? Oh, shit. Oh, and the bubble guy is changing direction. Oh, and more. Look. Look how crazy this guy is. Isn't this nuts? Oh yeah, stop and then keep moving. Yeah, do some more of your uh, non-satellite tricks for us, thank you. Uh, oh, thank you. Oh, that's a bus whizzing by. Hey, that's nice. Oh, a little trick, thank you for the little, oh, another little trick. Oh, that's perfect, thanks. Do loop there? Oh, it's some more. Oh, geez, that was a fast one. He's taking off and he's blinking too. Yeah. Where's the loop de loop go? Shoot. My arm's killing me anyway. This thing is really heavy. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Isn't that nuts? Now, uh, somebody needs to count these for me and post it on the comments. How many they counted on there? Because it's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous number of these guys. Crossing the side, that one just is going in the arc. I had to move the camera in the arc to follow this guy. Yeah, he's doing like a full half circle arc motion. Just following him. He's heading down towards the 
ground again. I have a 5X magnification lens on with a regular one, you know. And this is a touch to an HD cam. But then I know this. It's ridiculous. Kelihatan dua UFO sedang berkeliaran di kawasan Mentari, Sambil. Kelihatan seperti uh, permainan tapi mari kita saksikan visual ni. Describe, describe.
you kind of didn't see before because the sun, the sun yeah. was just flashing by. Co to jest? Ufo? A jak trzeba krzyczeć? A gdzie? Nie wszystkie. Ej, patrz, ten ma czarny i ten ma czarny. Ej, nie? Ty to tak cicho. Trzeci ma czarny, zobacz. Ty one gasną i lecą na dół. Wapa, pa, 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 leci na dół prawie. Ej, co go? No właśnie. No. Jakbym była pijana, to by się nie myślała. Ej, patrzcie, co to kurde. Play Area Sky. Want to show you the dash cam uploaded video on YouTube that shows what appears to be the fireball as it crossed around 7.45. Close, but no cause for alarm. Scientists have dismissed any chance asteroid 2012 DA14 will pose a threat to Earth. It's about 50 meters wide and weighs about 130,000 tons. No object of this size has passed so close to Earth since records began, and it's an event that only happens once every 40 years. The close approach of this, this object 2012 DA14 on February 15th is nothing to worry about. Its orbit is very well known. We know exactly where it's going to go, and it cannot hit the Earth. His second term, from looming questions over Benghazi, to the war in Afghanistan. Keep it here as our special coverage of Inauguration Weekend continues. Nochmal genauer hingeschaut, also da scheint es nicht zu geben. Trotzdem, ähm, Herr Professor Schlepp war an diesem Tag, ähm, sollte man sich vielleicht Drei. Da, der Tatsache vergewissern, dass wir alle nicht ewig leben und so ein bisschen uns der eigenen Endlichkeit ähm, vielleicht das nochmal gewahr werden. Ja, natürlich, aber das machen wir nicht gerne. Das ist unsere große Angst, dass wir vorbestimmt dazu sind, einmal zu sterben. Das macht uns Angst. Und gerade solche Katastrophenszenarien lenken von dieser Angst. Ja, Und ist damit auch... Ja, Kakusia. Und vielleicht sollten wir uns bemühen, ein bisschen gelassener unserem eigenen Ende entgegenzugehen. Ja, ne, mal gut. Weil es unausweislich ist. Vielleicht kommt dann ein bisschen mehr Lebensfreude auf und mehr Energie. Yeah. Two lights, that Steve. Mysterious lights hovering in the skies across several parts of the country. This video is from Indianapolis of a strange formation that appeared this week. Now, people in Metro Detroit say they've seen something just like it. For years, the Air Force conducted an investigation of so-called UFOs. They found no official proof anywhere from the feds tonight about those strange lights. 
Well, you wonder if the military is involved, as one of our uh, UFO experts uh, was curious there and mentioned. We did put some calls into Selfridge. The FAA, we didn't get any reaction. Could be a logical explanation for some of these light displays. I'll tell you this, there's no full moon right now, but we're getting an awful lot of reports of lights in the sky, Huel. Certainly not a weather balloon, Ron. All right, thank you. That's right. <laughs> Huh? It just came out of nowhere. Down at Maya. Shh. I know. Oh, three! Whoa! 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 I know what in the world came out of nowhere. Came out of nowhere. What in the world? This is some stuff. This is some stuff. Somebody has got to be shooting at you. And now they're all going underground. Look, watch another one. What is that, though? I don't know. Can you see it? This is unbelievable. Oh my gosh. Unbelievable. Wednesday morning. Locals say the light appeared to be bigger than the moon. Thousands of Norwegians bombarded the Meteorological Institute to ask what that light could have possibly been. Some feared it could have been a meteor. Others a black hole, and there are even those that thought it could be aliens. A strange spiralling white light was spotted in the early morning sky over Sydney, with even sceptical witnesses wondering if it was a UFO. The unusual sight was recorded by hundreds of people from Victoria north to Queensland. A spiral in the sky around a bright light. Scientists left baffled by an unexplained circular light seen hovering high over Moscow on Wednesday evening. People described it as seeing a wide circular formation in the sky. Footage capturing the spectacle will help but whether scientists and, and specialists find an explanation for the event. What was in the skies over Jerusalem? And why did it stop over one of the most treasured sites in Christianity? There's a new video this morning that some say may be proof we're not alone in the universe. A UFO in the form of a bright light is seen descending over the dome of the rock in Jerusalem. The video is said to be taken over the weekend. Uh, then suddenly the light shoots up into the sky. Here you see it. Another video from a different angle uh, appears to show the light doing the same thing. Now it is sparking intense debate on the internet. Trace Gallagher following this live from our West Coast News. So the question is, what was that UFO? What was it doing over Jerusalem? And, you know, is he back? Yeah, and that is the question, by the way, Megan, because, you know, critics, it's, it's difficult for them to dismiss this because there are so many different angles. We've got four different videos, all from various perspectives, but they do not know of anything like this in the Israeli army. All right, because listen, I don't, I don't like to be scared. I, I just can't take it. It's, you know, I don't know what it is. Well, I wish I could give you an answer to this bizarre sighting. I really can't, but I can tell you that earlier today, there were dozens and dozens of people right here on 23rd and 8th. They were standing right here, and they were all in a stupor, just crowded together, looking into the sky. Well, a lot of people are looking up. It's because of a mystery in the sky. Is it a balloon, a UFO? Whatever it is, it sure has a lot of people talking. I would assume reporter Jeff Begay is live in Chelsea, where crowds have gathered. Jeff, what's this all about? Well, Sade, we don't know.
день. Все, пропали. That again. Did you get that? Yeah, I'm videoing all this. It's on video right now. So I just want to get it again. Please do it again. I think they're talking to us. Oh. See the work the sun, the sun yeah. is just flashing by. Czarny i ten ma czarny. Ej, nie? Ty, ty to tak cicho. Trzeci ma czarny, ty zobacz. Ty one gaszną. I lecą na dół. Patrz, 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 leci na dół. Ej, co? No właśnie. Nie. Jakbym była pijana, to bym chciała, żeby mi się to... Ale to jest za pierwotę. Patrzcie, co to kuźde. Co to jest? Foki. Patrzcie, tam już spadają na nas. Te na lepędzi zderzą się. A ty nie wiesz na nas. I spada. Więc zawsze mamy się na nas. No patrzcie, ale już leci. Na co leci? Co to może być? Просто пипец какой-то. Смотри, что появляются слева, блядь. Где, откуда? Вот слева идут. 
Видишь, еще появляются, блядь. Слева я не знаю, это где. Ну над домами, блядь, вон, видишь, две штуки еще, блядь, будут. Ха-ха! Космические корабли! Ну это жестоко. Я ты, блядь, сразу зарал, блядь. Ну я слышал. Охуеть надо, блядь. Твою ногу. Я Под даже не знаю. Я, я даже не знаю, куда смотреть. Под облаками идут, блядь. Под облаками. А что а снимать? Я даже не знаю. Ну, тут, их, тут их миллион. А как я тебе их все? Они в камеру не вмещаются. По очереди, блядь. Ой, сейчас попробую хотя бы один увеличить. Один он уходит влево, видишь, блядь. Нет, я хочу увеличить. No, they're he ain't gonna see him. Uh, yeah, mom, they're not a okay, mom, will you take him inside? Do you hear me? Go with Granny. Your whole sky outside the back. The hell Look at that one over there. Look at that one. Did you just see that? We're taking a picture of it right now. Hold on. Something going real slow. Alex, it looks like aliens or angels. It's very, it's, uh, I've never seen anything like this in my life. Yeah, I just came in. Погоди, погоди, я тебе отвечаю, там что-то летало. Во, 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 офигенно. Офигеть! Лоб прям над нашим сраным городом. Блин, 
Я знал, что они существуют. Слушай, они как будто разговаривают, да? Вообще клево. Все, копали. That again. Did you get that? Yeah. I'm videoing all this. It's on video right now. So I just want to get it again. Please do it again. I think they're talking to us. Oh. Straight up in the air, people. Let me try to get them over. Torches over here. I know they're not just showing up for me. I don't think I'm special in any way. I just think that there's that many of them. And anybody that has a
Kelihatan dua UFO sedang berkeliaran di kawasan Mentari, Sambil. Kelihatan seperti uh, permainan tapi mari kita saksikan visual ni. Describe, describe. How long has it been here? What do you think is that, Mr. Nanda? For the past half an hour, they've been kissing. Mr. Nanda has no lap here. Я даже не знаю, я, я даже не знаю, куда смотреть. Под облаками идут, блядь. Под облаками. А что, а что снимать, я даже не знаю. Ну, тут, их, тут их миллион, а как я тебе их все, они в камеру не вмещаются. По очереди, блядь. Ой, сейчас попробую хотя бы один увеличить. Один он уходит влево, видишь, блядь. Нет, я хочу увеличить его. А. Максимум. Сколько смогу. Ну шары, шар. Куда насчет такой? Вон они вправо пошли, видишь, по блядь. Ебена мать. Тут 50, блядь. Да не меньше 50, согласен. Да они все, все равно лезут и лезут. So It's like a big fiber mm -hmm. or something. It's coming from everywhere. Yeah, it's coming from the, uh, look at those clouds. Those suspicious looking clouds right there. There's one right above us coming down on top of us. Neither have I. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Oh, I know. Uh huh. What the fuck? Why? Wow, look, just look up in the top of us. Look at all that shit that's floating on us. What the hell is all that stuff? Ага. Погоди, погоди. Я тебе отвечаю, там что-то летало. Во, во, во. О, офигенно. Странным городом. Блин, я знал, что они существуют. This is amazing.
Some of them are in triangle formation. Wow. I've never in my life seen anything like this. How many do you think there are? I have no idea. It's scaring me. This is unbelievable. They're still coming. What are they? I don't know. We saw a big triangle formation in the same quadrant of the sky on November 2nd. Cars coming. Last time I did this on the second, people blowing their horns at me. Oh, there's another row of them coming back there. Look. It's 845, November 7th, 2013. We're in Chandler, Arizona, which is southern South Phoenix. There's still some more coming up from behind that tree. It's really hard to take pictures of them. I hope they show up in the video. I can see them flickering in the video, but they're not flickering when I'm looking at them. There's several more behind that bank of trees. I saw four. They just haven't came up yet. That's crazy. Where do they all go? I have no idea. There's some over there behind that tree. Four of them. There's my daughter. I don't know where those other four went. They were in a vertical line right behind that tree same distance away are you serious you still see him
but that's like it's like a special ops fucking destroyer. Like what the <laughs> <laughs> military sending yeah, in the military sending in their fucking what if, what if there's like, army shit. Dude, what if we just see a helicopter explode right now? Boom! All right, here we go. A helicopter's heading over there. All we know is that orb of energy is still there, bro. It's still chilling. Look, he's turning. They're turning, bro. They're circling it. Oh, bro, they're circling it. <laughs> Dude, no fucking way. Look at the music. Is that another one? It's really small. Yeah. It's like, it's like... They're circling it, bro. It's going right by it. You see that shit? Yeah. The other, the, uh, I think I only see two now. How's your one? Is What's your, one? Dude, that one right there is like a gangster. Oh. Like, he's like. As UFO sightings go, this one was as good or as weird as it gets. A light appearing high in the Arctic sky, baffling those who saw it and exciting a lot of comment. Early yesterday morning, just before dawn, this appeared in the Norwegian sky. A blue light, small at first, growing into a spiral and then disappearing into what appeared to be a black hole. In the northern community of Trondelag and on a Norwegian military base, cell phones snapped, video cameras rolled, and bloggers got busy. That tonight, Norwegian authorities were investigating strange lights seen in the Arctic sky. The spiraling white light was seen for several minutes Wednesday morning. Locals say the light appeared to be bigger than the moon. Thousands of Norwegians bombarded the Meteorological Institute to ask what that light could have possibly been. Some feared it could have been a meteor. Others a black hole, and there are even those that thought it could be aliens. A strange spiraling white light was spotted in the early morning sky over Sydney with even skeptical witnesses wondering if it was a UFO. The unusual sight was recorded by hundreds of people from Victoria north to Queensland. A spiral in the sky around a bright light. A scientist left baffled by an unexplained circular light seen hovering high over Moscow on Wednesday evening. People described it as seeing a wide circular formation in the sky. Footage capturing the spectacle will help whether scientists and, and specialists find an explanation for the event. What was in the skies over Jerusalem? And why did it stop over one of the most treasured sites in Christianity? 
There's a new video this morning that some say may be proof we're not alone in the universe. A UFO in the form of a bright light is seen descending over the dome of the rock in Jerusalem. The video is said to be taken over the weekend. Uh, then suddenly the light shoots up into the sky. There you see it. Another video from a different angle uh, appears to show the light doing the same thing. Now it is sparking intense debate on the internet. Trace Gallagher following this live from our West Coast News. So the question is, what was that UFO? What was it doing over Jerusalem? And, you know, is he back? Yeah, and that is the question, by the way, Megan, because, you know, critics, it's, it's difficult for them to dismiss this because there are so many different angles. We've got four different videos, all from various perspectives, but they do not know of anything like this in the Israeli army. All right, because listen, I don't, I don't like to be scared. I, I just can't take it. It's, you know, I don't know what it is. Well, I wish I could give you an answer to this bizarre sighting. I really can't, but I can tell you that earlier today, there were dozens and dozens of people right here on 23rd and 8th. They were standing right here, and they were all in a stupor, just crowded together, looking at... ...of so-called UFOs, they found no official proof anywhere from the fence tonight about those strange lights. Well, you wonder if the military is involved, as one of our uh, UFO experts uh, was curious there and mentioned. We did put some calls into Selfridge, the FAA. We didn't get any reaction. Could be a logical explanation for some of these light displays. I'll tell you this, there's no full moon right now, but we're getting an awful lot of reports of lights in the sky. Huel? Certainly not a weather balloon, Ron. All right, thank you. That's right. <laughs> Huh? It just came out of nowhere. Down at Maya. Shh. I know. Oh, three! Whoa! 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 I know what in the world came out of nowhere. Came out of nowhere. What in the world? This is some stuff. This is some stuff. Somebody has got to be shooting at us. And now they're all going on to the ground. Look, watch another one. Come what is that, though? I don't know. Can you see it? This is unbelievable. Oh my gosh. Unbelievable. It is right there. 845. What is going on? There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 20 at least. Here comes a, that sounds like a military chopper. What is that? <laughs> 